Okay, so birthday haul. I'll start with Sephora. So basically I had birthday money and I was trying to bank up my points at Sephora. So this is all last week. I'm keeping it. I'm not returning it. I'm not going to, um, in a, because actually I bought this in the store. I didn't buy anything online. Okay, so to begin, we've got my birthday VIB Rouge gift, which is NARS this year. And I actually really like this. Um, so there are two uh, NARS lip crayons uh, in Rikugin. Is that the name? Yeah. So satin lip pencil. And then Cruella Velvet Matte Lip Pencil, um, which is a dark red. And then VIB Rouge, get the Larger Than Life Longwear Eyeliner in Via Veneto. And it's black. And it's nice. I really like it. Okay, so that's the VIB Rouge birthday gift. So, I've been using the Basha uh, Sabuki Oil Cleanser. And I'm out of it, so I decided to try a new Basha cleanser, and this is a breakup makeup breakup cool cleansing oil. And this is oil. I mean, it's oil. <laughs> uh, and I love the pump, and I love. I've started using it already. Um, it works really well. Sometimes I put it on my eyes, but normally I just don't. I use my Bioderm from Beautylish. But it smells nice, it feels nice, and it rinses clean. It does not stick around like that Pacifica oil I didn't like. Ugh. Okay, these I thought were so cool. Peter Thomas Roth Invisible Acne Dots. Um, there's 24 in here, and I think, is this $10, $12? Um, but they're kind of like those little wart discs that you put on, but they are invisible. I don't know if you'd want to wear them out during the day because then that might feel a little self-conscious, but they are very, you cannot see them. I think what would be great is to wear them at night. Um, they've got salicylic acid, tea tree oil, and hyaluronic acid, so they are just basically like putting zit cream on a zit and going to bed, but it stays on. So I think it's cool. I bought them for my daughter because she gets... You know how you just get those big old zits? Well, I'm going to use it too. In fact, I have one under my, whatever, you don't want to know. Okay, I went ahead and got the HD uh, Make It Forever Ultra HD Foundation. I have been hemming and hawing over this. That and the Born This Way Too Faced, which I'll show you in my Ulta haul. I just, uh, you know me, I'm out for my Holy Grail foundation. I got color 118. Oh, and it comes with a sample. It comes with the step one in hydrating. Nice. Um, I put on my Instagram, I had one side of my face was the HD and one side of my face was the Too Faced. And by the way, this Sephora haul is kind of a couple days combined because that was last week. Anyway, um, and I don't know which I like better. I'm having a hard time deciding. But I'll let you know. I've got to do more research. Anyway, it's it's a very nice formula. Um, okay, so there's that. Oh, this is new from the Sephora collection. It's called Bright Future Gel Serum Concealer. And I thought it would be maybe a dupe to the NARS Creamy Concealer. Um, I bought the shade Madeline. Um, and I'm think it might be a little too dark. I don't know. It was only $14. So I thought, I'll give it a try. It sounded good. Gel, serum, concealer. I don't know. Um, I love the travel section, the mini section. So I got a few items and so they gave me the travel approved bag. You get that free. I got this sheet mask from Radiance, is that no, Tony Moly, and it has two in here. It's the Radiance one, the Tomato Face Sheet Mask. I definitely want to try it. Um, they had others for like blemish, dehydration, I can't remember. And then I love that Touch and Soul so much, the Browsa. I thought I would try their mascara. It's the Stretch X and the Paper Pusher. There's two mascaras in here called Mini Magic. It's a set exclusive to Sephora. 
and it was $15 and it's apparently supposed to get long lash effect and maybe this is fibers stretch fiber lengthening so fun mascara from Korea and then I got a bite lipstick I was just like I'll take one of these and I'll take one of these and I got the it's the little dual thing come up oh, wrong end sorry in fig and date and I thought it was pretty because it was kind of like a one is like rosy pink that's the fig and then this is the date side did I do that right yeah and this is like a nude so ooh, and it's not sheer but it's it's nice so there you go and bite lipsticks are really they're just very pleasant uh oh did I do that wrong I gotta check so this is um fig and this is date and I don't know if I did that right I mean so you can see it just which the dollars it's so cute bite lipsticks are really nice and then I splurged um, because <laughs> I just had my 43rd birthday. Thank you. And thank you for all your sweet birthday wishes. I loved it. Thank you so much. Um, I got the Dr. Brandt Needles No More. I have not resorted to needles uh, yet. Not saying I won't. Um, but this is supposed to be like the relaxing on expression lines. 100% reported that product visibly improves the look of expression lines after four weeks. So I'm focusing it on here and here. And I don't think it's working yet. It was $89. So yeah. And last, I got this spray, because I love a spray. And this is Gel Mist Too Cool for School. Transforming gel to mist, moisturize, revitalize. Contains 5% rosemary water. Made in Korea. I don't think I need to mix it. I haven't tried it yet. Oh, it smells nice. Mmm. Mmm. It's pretty. Okay, that's it from Sephora. Good lord, child. Now moving on to Ulta. Um, so this is another kind of combined haul. Uh, there was a new store opening a week ago, two weeks ago. I think this is kind of from last week, the last week. Anyway, I got this bear. My face was freaking out. I was breaking out and it was dry and it was weird and I don't know why. So I got the Bare Minerals Complexion Rescue in Buttercream. And I have to say, it is a very nice sheer tinted, well, it's called a Tinted Hydrating Gel Cream with Broad Spectrum SPF 30. And it really does hydrate and it really kind of gives your skin a nice glow like it. I got the Born This Way. I need to do like a, a look. I need to do the, I did it, uh, Warm Beige is the color I got. I almost feel guilty because I got the Makeup Forever and I got this, but these seem to be the two big foundation launches this summer and I did get a sample of this some time ago and it is lovely it really really wears very nice so I'm just gonna see if it's worth it and I got whim lacquers in the top coat and the base coat I haven't decided yet if I love these um, I did get that torque your tail feather shade that was discount so that was cute this is Pacifica pore refine that oil cleanser went back and I got this is a mask a deep detox mask with blackberry strawberry and lemon peel it's hundred percent vegan and cruelty free and it's a very thin gel mask that goes over the skin you can it smells, yummy. It smells like berries um, but it's for clogged pores and to refine the skin and it is very gentle I like it okay 
And for Ulta, your birthday, you get an Urban Decay perversion, or at least this month you do. I think they change it based on the month. Um, so it's a deluxe sample of the perversion mascara, which I've used before and I enjoy. So there is that. And I got, because I'm kind of on my lash kick, I got these Benefit Lashes. I don't know if you can see. They're called Starlet Lash, and they are just, I think, kind of natural looking. What do you think? So I haven't tried them on yet. And then I got four NYX lipsticks. They said new colors on their displays. So for the matte lipstick and the matte cream. Is that what? Yeah, soft matte lip cream. So I got, do, 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 do. Oh, um, this is Couture Mode, and I think it's too light. Okay, so that's really soft pink, but yeah. And then this is Spirit Esprit. She has a little more color. I know, it's like, are you kidding me? They're the same. And I am wearing the lip cream in Buenos Aires, which I had something on my lips before I put it on, and I think that interacts with it because it doesn't have a great coverage, but it's pretty. And then this one is Ibiza, and it's pretty. Yeah, it's more like it, right? So that's, the f that's Ulta. Okay, you guys, I was a bad girl. I went to Neiman Marcus, but let me just say, I got a gift card, thank you, Betsy, and it was my birthday, and I'm gonna keep using that excuse. So I got some Chanel things, which I never get, and I think that's the whole point of birthday money is to get something you never get. But I have been coveting these cream Long Wear Luminous Eyeshadow. And this one is in Epitante. And I think Glam Life Guru has shown this on her channel. And I dug into it already. And it's like this greenish, metalish, metalish? Did I see a hair? Maybe the hair's on me, I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna stick my finger in it for you. It's basically a cream eyeshadow, which Maybelline, Maybelline makes cream eyeshadows for six dollars um, because these are 36 I think um, but it is this beautiful shade that has silver and green and gold and I don't know it is just like it looks silver but then if you hold it up to another shade they have that is silver you can tell that this is very green and it's just beautiful and she says it's always sold out so for it to be in stock was kind of you know, the universe telling me I need to get it. It could be used as a liner, as a cream eyeshadow, um, just amazing. And then I got their summer. They had just one for summer called New Moon or Fall. Is this their fall collection or their summer collection? I don't know. But I was like, I'll just get two. Because why not? And this, oh, it's, I said it already, it's New Moon. I cannot open it. And it is, oh God, it's gorgeous. Look at that. So this is rosy, bronzy goodness. I mean, it looks, do you see that? I mean, it's gold, it's rose, it's bronze, it's, it's magnificent. I can't even, I can't even. And then I got a waterproof um, eyeliner because it was, it was just there on the display um, called Erebel, Erebel 919. Let's just use that. And this is just kind of like your automatic eye pencil. Lovely. Stylo. Yeah. Waterproof. And it is, I'll put it here like this really pretty gold and I thought it would look really pretty in my waterline and below. Yeah, it's nice. 
it's just it's soft it's pretty and then last the orbe super fine hairspray this stuff you guys this is like when all the celebrities use and i know and it's ridiculous and it's a can of 36 dollar hairspray 33 dollar hairspray but it's the best it smells nice it lasts forever So there you go. I'm an extravagant hussy. You know it. Okay. I just love it. I'm frugal sometimes, but sometimes, girl, I got some caviar taste. Caviar champagne. I don't know what it is, but I have, I have, I like good stuff. I am not frugal, frugal all the time. So what I think I'll do for you guys is I'll do like a look using some of the fancy makeup or the you know the Chanel and the and stuff and I'll just incorporate it now and then and let you know if it's worth it because I think then that's kind of every now and then it's good to buy something high quality or it's good to treat yourself and so um, if you're gonna spend your money I will let you know what to spend your money on how about that so don't don't run away from me if I um, use expensive things on my channel from time to time because Hey, there's, you know, there's a reason for it. But anyway, there you go. There was my mega birthday haul. And thank you for joining me. And I hope you can subscribe and um, come back for more of me. <laughs> and uh, find me on all my other social media outlets. I'll put them in the drop down box below. And thank you so much. And have a great day. Mwah.